TeamWorld is a quick video on how I'm actually uh, sending messages to the sub objects. Uh, in this demonstration, I'm going to send a message to the CryptoPunk uh, uh, that's currently on the Bitcoin testnet uh, blockchain. So to get this to happen, I'm using Apertus.io, this uh, software that uh, invented at HugPuddle, uh, to uh, etch a transaction uh, that uh, the block, that SUP will interpret as a message to be displayed uh, on the uh, CryptoPunk object. Uh, so first, I'm going to select the blockchain. Uh, you, you know, we've got Apertus.io has the ability to communicate with most any altcoin uh, based off of Bitcoin. Uh, but we're doing these tests on Bitcoin testnet because it's uh, this is core functionality testing. <clears throat> so we'll select Bitcoin testnet from the list, and then I'm going to currently select a, an account that has Bitcoin testnet uh, coins in it. And then uh, I went out to the object and I copied its address, uh, which you can do by clicking on the, the image on the details panel or uh, clicking on the title or clicking on the name. Uh, there's lots of ways to get the uh, the address of the object. But this here is the a is the address of the object. <clears throat> and the message that I'm going to send to it is uh, send me a Bitcoin testnet address, Leonidas, <laughs> which is a video that I recorded earlier today. Uh, so basically I placed the message in here and uh, currently in a Pertis, uh, there isn't kind of like a uh, SUP isn't totally uh, supported in Apertus because the SUP is new and Apertus is old, but you can use Apertus to do things uh, in SUP. And I'm using Apertus to route this message to the object. All right, so I put the routing address here in my message, and also I put the uh, message. <clears throat> and I'm going to select uh, a signature that I have, so have created a profile on so that when I send this message, uh, it'll... Uh, my name and information will show up along with it. And so I have this profile called Fake UFO Creator that I set up. And I selected it from a list here. All right, now to send the message, I'm gonna hit this etch button and it will actually uh, 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 etch the message onto Bitcoin Testnet. <clears throat> there you go. And it happens that fast as well. And actually, if you go out to bitfossil.com right now, it shows up immediately out on the internet. Because bitfossil.com is searching the mem mempool and showing you all the objects that it finds in the mempool, even before they get confirmed. Uh, they'll just be in this pending state. So immediately after you post, it, post the, your message, you can see it on Bitcoin Testnet. And then after your message confirms, it'll show up in the sub object browser. We are working on it so the SUP object browser can also inspect the in-memory pools, uh, but that won't be uh, in a, that'll be in a, a few releases uh, down the, the line. Not many though. We expect to have it this fully functional, and I'll be performing my first trade in December. All right, have a great day, and uh, now you can see this message from me on the CryptoPunk.